Blair. It's me, Armand. First of all, I want to give a note. Please like and subscribe I, because that will really support our channel. I went to a train show oh, like a week ago, I think, and I found this product from Lionel of all, all pr companies. And it's this, Thomas Hazarder Set. I have high hopes for this set because it says authentic train sound. Now it's moving guys. Uh, authentic train sounds. Okay. Okay. Let's get actually. Let's get into the unboxing now. Bam! We've opened it. Now let's look at him and oh. His face looks scary. I, I, I can't imagine how scary this look. What was Lionel thinking? I'd rather buy the old Lionel James rather than this, but whatever. The solution is changeable faces. Something the old Lionel Thomas models didn't have. So, like, there's three other faces you can put on. Like, let me put the first one on right here. And my favorite one that actually doesn't scare me But yeah, I guess I'll keep this face on. Now let's get to the coaches. Okay, here's Annie. You can take off their hair, hair roof and put some stuff in and put it back in. You can also take it off and put it in. Back in. That's simple. Here's Clarabelle. Has the same same opening feature. Blah blah blah. Okay. Now let's get into this. This is the controller, so you can drive, Thomas. Haven't put it any batteries in it yet, but okay. Track, we need track. Nothing I'm going to talk about with these things. I'm not going to really talk about these things because you already know what these are. Let's talk about this product. There's something, so let's start off with the track setup. It's really, really hard for somebody like me. I really struggled and it hurted even though the track is supposed to be easy. Hell, even my dad tried helping out and it was hard for him to get it too. So, guess that sums it up. Um, I think I'd give this a 7 out of 10. You know what? An 8 out of 10. If you're willing to pay some expensive price, I'd say good, go for it. Let's do some train spotting now. Detailing might be a little misplaced, but I'm okay with that. So the face really depends on what you're running. If you're running on this face, it looks detailed, but they didn't do much detailing with the interior of the mouth besides coloring the tongue. If you're running on this face, perfectly, perfectly detailed. 
if you're running on this face, probably the best one you get. Let's talk about Annie here. Now, for some reason, Annie, his face looks a bit off, but that's all the downsides I have with her detailing. Everything is just fine, except where her eyes were put it, it looks a little weird to me. Same thing with Clarabelle. Same, little bit off eye placement, but let's get the sound now. The whistle, the bell, and the voice lines. All aboard! We're on track and on time! Also, there's a few more horror, horror while you're running, so let's just run slowly. And that sums up the sounds. Okay, we've got Thomas onto the rails and up. Why is a Bachman Thomas here, you might be wondering. Well, I'm kind of disappointed with this model's wheels. Instead of looking like the Bachman Thomas's wheels, which is very accurate detailed, the, the uh, Lionel Thomas looks like the Bachman and Scale Thomas's wheels. And that's a step down from the breeds on this thing. Bye!